hope you guys have enjoyed this. And look, we rescued a ninja. Yeah. And we're nursing him to health as if he was a little girl because the script didn't know what how to deal with the fact. Okay, I don't know what we do. That it could be two different characters. Okay, so I guess I need I don't need to talk to him like eight times in a row. Yeah, no, you gotta leave for a while and then come back. I think he maybe sh shows up. He shows up in the Coliseum later. But no, but I mean maybe he like runs out. Gung Ho? Is that guy's name Gung Ho? Yeah. Woo! He doesn't appear at Ever Rocks again. No, he hasn't. <laughs> I think you can go back there and fight him again, maybe. Maybe not. Oh, by the way, in the episode that we lost, one of the episodes we lost, we killed Hedon. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Sorry, that. All the fun places. So, uh, welcome back to the Super Spears Brothers. Last episode, we were talking about Gamelon of Thrones. Yeah. Um, Wand of Gamelon of Thrones. It looks like a fish! So... Our family, my family, doesn't my immediate family is not what I would call to have traditional gender roles. I do the cooking. My wife does most of the cleaning. I do like the uh, some of the tests. We try and split things up pretty well. Yeah. But one traditional role my wife like likes to do because I'm really bad at it. Yeah. She likes to do all the ironing. Yeah. And I don't really care if my stuff is ironed, but I do work in a professional office situation, so I appreciate that she likes to get the ironing done and she feels it's like kind of her job. Yeah. Because uh, I would do a shitty job of it. We all know this. Yeah. And so. Yeah. Uh, uh, if you look at Blake's character sheet, Shitty at Ironing is one of his feats. It's it's on there. It's, I don't know why he chose that as a feat. It seemed like a waste. Well, <laughs> Should I got like improved two weapon the, fighting. The, the thing is, is I put it really low, so when I do Shitty Ironing, I roll for it, and then if I get a really low number, my ironing's actually really good. Oh, okay. Because so I, you're I fail, I fail at my my, my uh, Shitty Ironing <gasps> feat. It's Humpty. Oh man. Do the dance. Uh, the, yeah. Do the hump. Do the hump to hump. Do the hump. Do the hump to hump. Uh, wind song, I guess. But um, the, the, that was one of the things that I missed most when Game of Thrones isn't on. Is wait, we're talking about Game of Thrones now? Yeah, yeah. Is that um, <laughs> you should have seen his head wheel back and forth when I <laughs> when I jumped back to Game of Thrones. Is uh, um, I would always introduce. Basically, when the kids are going to bed, we don't tell them that we have a party as soon as they're asleep. Yeah. Um, and so we're gonna go sit down and watch Game of Thrones, and uh, and so uh, I would just go up to my wife and say. Tonight, when we play, pay the iron price, and then she irons while we watch Game of Thrones. <laughs> so every she, day, every week, uh, every week that we that she, yeah, every week we would sit down and she would like do the ironing while we watch Game of and Thrones, and then you would make the joke. Uh, yeah. Every week, well, she or she would make it. It's it's one of the it's like, <laughs> we're married. You gotta have stupid shit that you say to each other. Oh pugs, or else you. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Ah! You can't. Ah! Ah! You I haven't saved. <laughs> 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 yeah, I hope that you kill him quickly, and then I, I think you just treat this like the ultimate boss. They're in this doom. In this doom them. I think you got a chance of killing them because they're not that strong. Oh, oh you. Oh, he's okay. Well, now you're fucked. <laughs> well, this guy's attack is pretty strong, actually. Yeah. And if you. Any counterattacks. Yeah. So maybe he's, maybe you got a chance because they they don't have a huge amount of hit points. No. If you can just survive and do a couple sunbathes or whatever. And maybe a wind slash? Uh, I hope wind slash works, except unless they counterattack magic by they, doing. They can't. Like, yeah, because it's, it's. Oh, I got a critical! Uh, oh. D attack him! Uh, I, attack! When, when they get close enough, right, they do. They do, they um, do the stabby thing. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, okay. you've got this. You've I got, got this. this. Oh, good, and he healed. He healed. That means I can take one more hit. Definitely. Good, yeah. good, 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 good. Yeah, but but you're running out of time. Boy, oh boy. Uh, I'm real scared this about this way pug. too stressful. I can't handle the pugs. They're too cute in their uh, little faces. Uh, Except he can only attack. He's looking at one guy's going to attack. Uh, Yay. Oh, my oh God. no. Oh, no. And then he's going to do the... He's going to do plasma on him. <laughs> plasma! <laughs> we could have had him at the pug abilities. Uh, don't do dance. That was yeah, you know what? Mistake. That was a mistake. Nothing to do with I the pugs. I admit that that was a mistake. I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna use a tent. That's a good idea. Or just go inside the ship and heal for free. I'm gonna use a tent. All right. I have lots of cash. I don't need to worry about that. I have lots of cash. Lots of cash. Lots of cash. Hi, I heard you were. That's uh, a good Moloch. I'm actually yeah. proud of that. Yeah. <laughs> I, I talked over it though, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> no one, would, no one will ever know about your good Moloch. Um, no one will ever know about your good Marlock. You can equip the behemoth suit. Um, I think it's for little people. I think it's like made a of behemoth hide, moss, and D. So just the old people. Oh yeah. Is it significantly better than? Mm, okay. 
Um, I don't know what I was gonna. Okay, I'm gonna save. That's a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> oh look, you're near forty nine ten. If you save in just like, like, uh, like a few more minutes, you can finally have that fifty minute, fifty hours. Moose. Oh my God. Ooh, muy good. Ooh, muy. Yeah. Oh, I wonder if the, I wonder if he gets the ability pep up, which kills yourself and gives a small amount of. Uh, like a very small amount of. HP. I, I, maybe it gives all your HP though to somebody random, which would maybe. not be so bad since that guy has no other purpose. Since he is a useless character, do I even have dried meat? Oh, uh, you must have some. Oh yeah. Oh, you don't need to. Oh. Oh, there we go. We got him. I'm in the party now. I'm in the party now. So should so should we uh, go around and? Oh God, he is low level. Should we go around and collect some Jafars? No, that's not worth doing right now. Oh come on! It's it's tedious. Like what the point now? Well, there's a bunch of stuff we could do that we should probably do off camera. There's a few things we need to do. No, this still. is this is fun. This is people love to see grinding. Grinding is like the reason that why they. That is empirically not true, but okay. <laughs> uh, pro, X zone. I think he has. All the old ones. So it's just these four new ones he needs. I guess I could give him. Oop, I actually give it to him. Give him, give him X Zone. Give, give him Palador. Palador is better. Haste two is whatever. Haste two is pretty damn good. Red cap, diamond best. Sure, whatever. Okay, and I will give him. Well, he needs actually. I should um. No. Take the experience egg off. I should fuck it up. Why not? Oh yeah, do you have to equip everybody? Oh, did you already equip people with their stuff? And who's learning Ultima right now? Um, uh, the, it's actually me. Okay, makes sense. Experience egg? You want to give him the yeah, experience, the experience egg? egg is what I want to give. Maybe you should give him something else to like protect him as well. Oh no, I was thinking he's gonna be doing jumping. Oh, but that's not a jump. The running shoes don't jump. No, but they give him haste. Oh, I see. So, I, oh, I oh, we're gonna we are gonna do collect some ba some baddies. Oh yeah, Matt Asko, that's a good one to have. Yeah. See, there you go. This guy becomes useful when you get the right skills, which is, I know, bizarre. Yeah. Uh, do, now, do you get the whole party whether you accidentally kill them or not? I think, I believe so, yeah. Because you have to kill them all for him to come back. Like, when he's coming back. Oh, that's true. You so I anything. assume so, unless the game is incredibly unfair. If there's anybody who's been watching this show to this do point... Do I have Ceratops? I don't need Ceratops. Uh, uh, can you run from Ceratops? There's a few weird little enemies that for some reason you just can't run from. I love them because when you fought them, they were monsters in a box or they were bosses or something. Yeah, yeah, that's right. And I think the battles are vaguely um, uh, chronological. So, like, you'll be building up to the tougher enemies and dragons and stuff like that. And then hmm. it goes back to the beginning again. Oh, Zeus. But, like, every battle... Uh, just a bail. Every battle brings you... Well, okay, now this fucker is going down. <laughs> How dare you steal that much of my money, sir? Okay, fine. I can, I'm gonna be a bear! Well, he, he could steal, theoretically, then. I wonder what happens if, the, if he uses Ursus. I don't think I don't think he steals. Because that would actually be really stupid, because that, that would be like, just like them summoning money out of nothingness. Yeah. Also, that bear stole like 8,000 gold, and I'm not, I didn't actually pay attention you, to see You I get it back. Oh, no. Do you get gold from that from Usually. this Usually. Psychot. Are these guys worth getting? I don't think you got your money back. Psychot's pretty good. Intangir. Oh yeah, what does Intangir do? Pep up. <laughs> well! <laughs> Erased from history. <laughs> He's just gone! <laughs> that was, um... A bad thing? <laughs> no, don't use it. I didn't... Because there's only one in the party at a time. No, well, also the, the pep up is also done by that moose thing. Yeah. So, but no, 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 but they, that's why I've never So seen now are you to, dead? Though. You're dead. Yeah, he's wounded. Yeah, there, you don't actually die in this game canonically when you, when you Even have Even though a... you cast life. Yeah, well life is just like what they, people call it. It's yeah. just like a, one it's, of it's the... It's like what we call life. Yeah, that's right. My, my so-called life. Oh, oh, you know what? And with my... 1990s. With my, uh, with, with my um, uh, brother with uh, autism? I can't remember what he fucking had. Is that some, my so-called life? Uh, Where the yeah. brother has some sort of thing, yeah, you know the thing that the brother has. Yeah, and then there's the uh, the um, the the gay the gay friend. Oh, the... um, Gargamel. Yeah, Gargamel's the gay friend. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he's always trying to, to capture capture those the the um the slayers. Yeah, 
That's right. Oh, it's that's a pinnacus. A... You know, this is what I should call people who I'm um, actually people on Twitter. What? A pinnacus. A pinnacus. And just like that's just. Actually... Oh, a pinnacus rex. Yeah, because they rex the conversation. Oh yeah! I remember one time I was in a English class, and this is like the best pun, and situationally the best pun I ever made. Not a funny pun. I can yeah. tell you right now, it's not a funny pun. But situationally, it was great. We had, I had a teacher that wanted to tie everything back to Oedipus Rex. Yeah. And everything was like an Oedipal complex or related to like, you know, the concept. Were they actually Freud? Uh, no, because Freud probably wouldn't have done that. This is an English teacher, remember. English teachers have no fucking idea about how to do anything. <laughs> That's why they're becoming... But this is a university, so they're kind of... They were too pathetic to become, like, teachers in a, in a, uh, in a school. Yeah. Um, so anyway, uh... They had gone through, and then they, she was describing how um, that poem Ozymandias, yeah, Ozymandias, which um, takes place in the, around the same time as, as Oedipus Rex, Rex, but is is written was written in like the nineteenth century. It's not really. Well, it's from isn't it? Isn't it? Ri- it's about ancient. Um, but it's the end of the Egyptian period, which is Ramses the, though was one of the pyramid builders, so he would have been way earlier. So it would have been like a thousand um, no, but years it's, but it's written from when uh, uh, that thing was all destroyed. Right? Yeah. Look upon these my works, you mighty in despair. Uh, How do I wake somebody up? A uh, slap them or use a spell. Like a like a wake up spell. But don't worry about Rain Man anyway. They're not that great. Just kill them. Okay. But I could put people to sleep, like. I'm not sure if you could. I, could I mean, finally be a university professor. <laughs> Speaking of university professors, they have board three. Come on. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm getting him. I'm getting him. Getting him. All right. All right. The goat man has spoken. I'm not sure if you, what you actually get from these guys, but go ahead. Um. Anyway, so the uh, so so her thing was that was connecting everything to. Oedipus Rex, and she was talking about Ozymandias, and then she was talking about describing how all this stuff was destroyed, yeah. and 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 trying to tie it back. What I knew where she was tying it back, yeah. so I said, "So you're saying that all his edifices were wrecked?" That <laughs> uh. like like, and she and everybody lost it for a <laughs> long time after that. It was a pretty dumb pun, but it like it just cl- cinched the whole class into like one line. Yeah, because also you said it before she brought up Oedipus Rex. That's right, just be- just before. Yeah. So I was like, well, please, please fucking hope to call on me. My hands up. <laughs> it's really fucking important. She's like, well, it's kind of like. <laughs> a good way to get a teacher's attention is make monkey sex noises. That's right. Or to start masturbating and throw your poo. Yeah. It really works well. It's it's the hey, same thing, really. hey, folks, if you're in high school or you're studying college or university, um, here's some great tips to help you get better grades. Tips with Blake. Number one, if you want the teacher's attention, try shitting into your hand and throwing it at the teacher. Make sure you start humping the desk while you're doing it. Yeah. Want more tips? Want more tips? Um... Go ahead, ask me for more tips. Yeah, I'd love one more tip. Give me one more tip. All right, I'll give you the tip. Just not the tip. Not that tip. Just the tip? Not that. Here's uh, a tip. Don't make okay. any joke that could be construed of, as a joke about him having sex with you. Um, here's one. If you're doing poorly in a class, offer to suck the teacher's cock. Now, yeah. uh, the teaching assistant's cock. Because yeah, yeah. I had a few students that were really hot that refused to offer that service, and so I failed them. <laughs> <laughs> but... Um, Good thing this is on the record. And especially if it's a woman teacher, at say, I want to fucking suck your cock for an A. And they'll be like, I'm, so, I'm sorry? I don't quite understand. I'm going to fucking suck your cock for that fucking A. <laughs> I'll, do anything for your, I'll do anything for your D for that A. I want to exchange, change, exchange your D for an A. And then, and then, and <laughs> you already have an A. You're doing quite well. And if they're a heterosexual teacher and you're male, it doesn't make a difference. No. They're like, fucking, I'll, I'll fucking, my mouth will be your playground, motherfucker. <laughs> It'll be like it'll be like it'll be Mardi Gras, <laughs> and the beads will be in your ass. <laughs> fucking... Be really aggressive sexually too, <laughs> yes, yes, like in a really unpleasantly. Did you ever? Did you ever? Did you ever go to like the playground? You get on that little spinny like w- w- merry-go-round thing. You're gonna deep throw you so much like <laughs> both. That's what I'm going through. <laughs> <laughs> my, my my mouth will be like just the point when you're having fun, but before you start to really get sick, yeah. realizing that you've been on the merry-go-round, that's fucking when you're on the 
That's what you're in for. That's what you're in for. Uh, also, so, you want more tips? Yeah, yeah, I love one uh, more tip. What, you want a tip? Yeah. All right, all right. So is this, I like how it's a, co it's a covert. That's the name of the ninja, is covert. That's right. Oh, disappear. Ha <laughs> ha. I defended against your disappear. Oh, wow, he's actually really weak. When did that happen? Come on, jump. Don't shake your waist at me. <laughs> well, then what was that? Ah! <laughs> Ah, you could have survived, you fool! That was your failure. So you do get gold from these guys. So you probably did get your gold back. Yeah, probably. Um. Uh, but so so we got another tip this for you. This is the most visually boring episode we've ever done. Uh. But go ahead. No, you're well, finding lots of enemies. It's yeah, find lots of enemies in gray land. Yeah. Uh. Just like a sea of gray. Flan. Run away from the flan. I don't want flans. My secret flan. So here's another tip. Yeah, if yeah, you're yeah. in residence and you are really hungry in the middle of the night, remember, you're surrounded by food. <laughs> they don't even know it's coming. They've got shared showers. You can walk into literally any dorm. It's just a feast. Blood will go down the faucet. <laughs> Blood will go down the, the faucet. Drain. Not the faucet. The drain. Way. <laughs> if it went down the faucet. Unless it was fair faucet, it fucking drinks blood.